The Senate has already voted today in just the last hour to do something kind of interesting. It's not happening yet, but they're looking to make daylight saving time permanent as soon as next year. Meaning, you know how you just switched your clocks over the weekend? You, you won't have to do that anymore. It would make those afternoons in the winter a little bit brighter. It would make the mornings a little bit darker. Obviously, this still has to go to the House, but I want to bring in NBC News correspondent Leanne Caldwell because, Leanne, like this, talk about something that affects every American or most Americans, right, unless you live in maybe Arizona or Hawaii. But, like, to even think about the fact that maybe we're officially done with daylight saving is, is sort of weird. What's the deal? So, Holly, I think every parent with young children would probably jump up and down at this news. As you know, their body clocks, kids' body clocks, do not change very easily. Um, but, yes, yeah, so the Senate just passed by unanimous consent. There was no vote, and that means all 100 senators agreed, which is also very rare in the Senate, to keep daylight savings time. This is something that is bipartisan. It has 17 co-sponsors, Republicans and Democrats. And the Top Republicans in the Senate, uh, they were gaggling with reporters when this actually happened on the Senate floor. So Senator John Thune, the number two, who is responsible for counting Republican votes, had no idea this happened. And he was even shocked that it passed. But he said it's something that pretty much everyone agrees with. So, of course, as you mentioned, it then goes to the House of Representatives. We have no update yet if the House is going to take up this bill. But if they do, and if it passes, then it goes to the president's desk where he could either sign it into law or veto it. But I have a feeling that if he were to veto it, that would be overruled, given how popular this idea is on Capitol Hill, Holly. So do you, so is this real? Like, is this, could this really be, some, it sounds like it is, Leanne. It could be something that actually really passes sometime soonish. It could. It's something that every daylight savings time, every time the clock is about to shift, uh, there's members of Congress, Republicans and Democrats, House members, senators, who come to the floor and rail about the time change. They bring up legislation. This is something that happens every year, twice a year. And finally, legislation, this bill, has passed. And so, again, like you said, it has to go to the House. Um, but it is real, and it could happen. So uh, we'll see where this goes, Hallie. It's so, so very stay exciting tuned with for that parents. one. Leanne Caldwell, <laughs> yeah. thank you so much. Appreciate that.